this one. Hey, darling. <laughs> Dinner is ready. Huh? Did you go shopping? I needed new clothes, too. You bought a new phone. The old one was bad. <laughs> Baby, do we are spending money like this? I'm very worried, though. How will we not close our new shop? Uh uh. No, no. Anyway, I got the phone at the giveaway price, and as for the clothes, the owner said I can pay in a bit. Hello? Hey, Agata. Hi, Fred. Um, thank you so much for the money you sent to Daniel. Well, $1,000 was for you that I sent for. No, you don't need to send me money, I'm fine. Allow me to take care of you. Allow me to look after you. I'm fine taking care of myself. Thank you. You don't have to do that anymore. Agatha, you raised our child alone. You went through the pain, you went through the suffering alone. Now I want to take care of you, Agatha. Let me take care of you, please. So you think throwing money at me would solve that? Come on, that's not my intention at all. Think about it, Agatha. Daniel deserves a home with you, me, as a family. I'm, I'm sorry, what did you say? Agatha, I said think about it. Daniel deserves a stable, stable and steady home. We owe it to our son to give it a second chance with our relationship. I'm sorry. Dana has a very stable home. And as for me, I'm in a relationship and a very good one at that. You're in a relationship with a man who is not the father of your child? Come on, how do you think this is even going to play out? A man who is not the father of your child? How many men do you know that would marry a woman who already has a child for another man? How many? You know the funny thing? AJ isn't like that. He actually loves Daniel like his own son. Alright, if you say so. But, you know, I gotta think about it, please. There's nothing to think about. So what happened? Why is your face like that? Can you imagine? Try telling me that he wants, to, he wants us to give our relationship another try. And what is wrong with that? Are you being serious? He is the father of your son, and if he wants to commit, then allow him. He's in a better position to than any other guy. So what about AJ? Has he proposed to you? Has he not taken you to see any of his family members? My dear, be wise, oh. Uh -uh. A bed in hand is better than a thousand in the bush. I can't understand why you are against AJ. Why, why this sudden hatred towards him? I am not against AJ. I am just telling you the truth as a sister. It's better you commit to, to, to Daniel's father than allowing a single guy who don't even know his intentions. Don't wise enough. Bring all your eggs in one basket. Careful, don't spill that thing on your new on your uniform, okay? Are you done? <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> okay. All right. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Let's go. You know. Why are you looking at me? It's your mouth. You <laughs> get everything on you.
told you? Of course you did! Sorry, I'm so sorry. I, 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 my, my mind was somewhere else. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Um, so sorry, sorry. Um, you, you, what, what if I just take you to where, where you're going? Just like that. I'm sure you're no, going no. so... Ow! You're obviously upset. You're upset. And I won't be able to sleep at night if I knew I did this to you and at least I didn't try to make it better. Please. I'm, I'm fine. No, let me just... Let me, where are you going? I, I'm, I'm sure you were going somewhere else before now. Forget where I'm going. I don't care. Uh, let me just let me drop you off, please. Look, I, I'll manage. It's, yeah, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Please, please let me. I'm, I'm AJ. This is really weird, Agatha. Nice to meet you, Agatha. That's a lovely name. Please let me let me drop you where you're going, please. Are you sure you're not a ritualist? Is it, is it a hat? Yes, the hat. <laughs> let, let, let me drop you. So, did Madame massacre me? She didn't come. Oh, Bell. She did not come to work on time. When they do, they will start to gossip me. Uh, uh, ignore her. And I have, I have juice for you. Come in, I'll tell you. What is it? I'll tell you later. Take me now, now. So you are telling me that you met this fine guy mm -hmm. that almost hit you with his car mm -hmm. and then asked you out? Yes. <laughs> you didn't mind me. Which kind of talk be that? You sound like a Nollywood movie. Okay. How is like? Is he tall, cute, successful? What kind of car does he drive? I don't calm down. I beg now necessary information what you got to fill me with now. How you go just give me half gist? Well, he's good looking and he drives a nice car. Like the hit jackpot. Don't these people hear you know what's wrong with you? And so? And so what? Anyway, would you help me watch that now? Before, shadows make me some good things when you are coming back. I will, I will. I have to go and pick up the school. Hey! Stop it, Brad. Come. Valentine is coming. Hey, is your boyfriend. You are sitting at home. Lonely. Hello, Agatha. Good evening, darling. How are you? Ah, and how is Daniel? Oh, I see that young man is growing very fast every day. I see his auntie and his mom are taking good care of him. That's fine. That's fine. Bless you. I just wanted to check up on you. I haven't seen you ladies in church lately. What is going on? Oh, okay. But it's okay. I mean, that is the reason why we have the first service. Early service. It's for people like you who work on Sundays. So you wake up early on Sunday morning, come for the service. All right? And Daniel, too, I'm sure he would enjoy the children's church. It's actually amazing. Okay. Okay, so see you next Sunday, all right? All right. All right, take care. Bye. -bye. How is the ice cream? It's okay. You sure? Because if you don't like that, you can just have mine. No, 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 I'm fine. Oh, I could have them bring more food. No, I'm okay. You want anything else? Are you always this scary? What do you mean? You open doors for me. Make sure that I'm always okay. You put me before yourself. Why? Isn't that how it's supposed to be? I mean, a man should take care of the woman he's with, right? Well, 
most men would like to be taken care of by the women, so. Well, I was raised right. I'm not like most men. I believe a woman should be protected and cherished. Mm. Sure. So, tell me about yourself. <clears throat> There's nothing to tell. I'm just a, I'm a stylist at the salon. Mm. Are you in a relationship? Mm -mm. Me too. <laughs> Who would have thought? <laughs> Oh, okay. Honestly, I don't know how such a beautiful woman can still be single. Men, men will be blind, you know? <laughs> <laughs> But trust me, I am not blind. She is caring, so thoughtful, kind. <laughs> and she is caring. Stop. Stop. I beg, it's okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> But I don't think it will last. I think once he finds out about um, Daniel, he's going to run off. You don't know that. Vivian, do you think a successful, handsome, hardworking young man would date a single mother like me? Why would he want to go for second-hand goods when he can get the original one? Can you hear yourself right now? I can't believe you're even saying that. You are not second-hand goods, and any single mom doesn't make you less of a woman. <laughs> Society would disagree. Look, they see us as promiscuous, good for nothing, just because we have kids out of wedlock. Do you care about society? Of course I do. I don't. And who cares what the society thinks? <sighs> okay, so what are you saying? You're not going to see him anymore. Look. I don't want to raise my hopes up and get my heart broken all over again. Listen, I know you've been hurt so many times in the past. That doesn't mean you should stop believing. Someone out there is going to come for you, love you and your son just the way you are. Okay? Come on, smile. I still want to hear the food just Girl, come on. No. You had a good day, remember? Mm. Oh, yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's nice. You, you're still. You're, <laughs> I am. <laughs> yeah. So tell me, how was the meeting? Bro, you got the deal. We're the ones designing the apps for all the shops in the country. <laughs> so that, man, you know, you know what it is, man. <laughs> yes, my dude. Yeah. Uh, well, I'll take him in check on that. I have some other plans for the night, you know now. Which, um, I'm going to need you to take off for tomorrow. Come on, I've got work to do. You do it somewhere else. Okay, what if I stay in my room and be as quiet as some house? Uh, that won't work. Yeah. She's shy, you know, she'll feel uncomfortable if she sees another guy in the house. You know how these women are now. Hmm? I have to beg you now. Okay. Yeah? Uh -huh. But you, you pay for my car to turn from. Uh, yeah, yeah. That's good. That's good. That's good. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> that was 
How's dinner? Dinner's great. I don't really go out much. I'm always busy with work and my um, other things, so it's okay. it's nice coming here. Okay. I've officially decided that I'm going to make it my life's mission to show you all the trendy spots in town. You don't have to. Of course <laughs> I do. You don't. I honestly. do. I want to. Putting a smile on your face makes my day even lovelier. <laughs> Why do you always do that? What is the that? <laughs> you being sweet, caring. You're so intentional. Well, I thought the reason would be obvious by now. I like you a lot, Adada. I do. I think you are beautiful. Both on the inside and the outside. You're a queen. And I feel honored just spending time with you. Do you really mean that? With all my heart. And it will mean the world to me if you give me the chance to be the man of your dreams. <laughs> Is that a yes? That's a yes? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can I can I kiss you? Come here. Be <laughs> <laughs> yourself, I probably <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my humble abode. Oh wow. The home is lovely. Thank you. That was it. Thank you. Should I get you something to drink? Oh no, thanks. You sure? Mm -hmm. I'm fine. I'm full. <laughs> wow. I'll take your shoes off. No, no, no. Let, let me. I just feel like your feet might be hurting since you've been walking all day. You're always taking care of me. Always putting my needs first. You deserve to be taken care of, Adara. <laughs> what is it? Oh, come on, I knew you can tell me anything. No, 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 I'm not married. I, I'm just a single mother, that's all. Oh. And, uh, where's the father? I got pregnant in secondary school. And he refused to take responsibility. I've been taking care of my son ever since then. And I, I, I didn't want to tell you because I, I thought that you would not want to see me again. So you thought I was one of those men who judge men by their past? Most people do. Mm. No. I'm not like most people. Actually, what I think is you could have had an abortion, but you chose to keep the kid, even without the support of his, his, his the guy, his father. That takes boldness, courage, that takes strength. And um, if it's fine with you, 
I hope I get to meet him someday. Really? Of course. I mean, he's a big part of your life. And I'm hoping that someday I get to be a big part of your life as well. Hashtag is so lucky. I guess you're lucky to meet someone like you. I think the actual truth is, how did I get so lucky to meet such a beautiful soul? Well, his name is Daniel. Daniel? That's a beautiful name. Yes. <laughs> how old is he? He's seven. Ah, he's already a man already. Oh, I, I, <laughs> I mean, he's such a brilliant boy. I can, I can imagine. I've met his mom. I know where he's getting it from. Thank you. You flatter to me too much. <laughs> yes, he does. Ah, I see you already have some. I see. I'm ready to come, man. So I can, I'm, I'm, I'm sure we'll get along. Favorite player is Ronaldo. I say you want my to let me strong. Hey. Okay, you need to take it easy. It's project in Buffy here. It's in Buffy. Don't mind your mom, don't mind. Two of us. Two of us, don't worry. Coach and staff. You know that I have to get you He was hugging you. It is how we're supposed to be. It's my boy. It's your boy. It's my boy. I'm trying to swag out your car. <laughs> Okay, so I get out. Oh, you're my high day now. Hi, hi. It's not like I love you. How you doing? What are you looking at? You prostitute. What are you looking at? Oh, what are we watching, please? Well, what's your ah. 100? Well, I want to watch you, Daddy, too. Why do you want to watch you, Daddy? I heard the film is very good. It's a very good film. Going on. I've been trying to reach you all day. Are you okay? Why are you crying? What happened? 
Mama had an accident. <gasps> My goodness. And she's in the hospital. Is she okay? They need to operate on her and they're asking for 400,000 there. 400,000? Where am I supposed to get that kind of money from? <sighs> Ever since Papa died, my son Harry is what I have been using to take care of Mama and my siblings. I don't have any savings. Nothing. Look, look. We'll find the money. We will. And Mama will be fine. Nothing will happen to her. How? Where? If something happens to her, I don't think it will happen to her. We will look for the money. She's going to be fine. Please stop crying. Please. Please. We will look for the money. Um, Agatha told me about your mom. I'm so sorry. I'll give you 500,000 naira for the operation and you can use whatever is left for the rest of the bills. Did he just... Yes, he did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. It's so much. It's cool. It's cool. You're welcome. You're welcome. I don't want you to cry. It's cool. It's cool. It's no problem. It's no problem. It's no problem. <laughs> I can't believe that you would choose Fred over AJ. AJ that, that took care of me, took care of myself, and even you. I forgot he gave us money for the salon. And I will forever be grateful for that. But that doesn't change the fact that you are better off with Daniel's father. Do you know what that man put me through? Everybody makes mistakes, Avatar. At least he's repentant and wants to make a man. So because he's repentant, you go back to him after seven years. Seven years? Huh? As you choose a man who tossed his own bunch up into, into a garbage because he didn't want him. At least he's repentant. Unlike some people who are pretending to be perfect. What do you mean by that? AJ has some skeleton in his cupboard too. It was a misunderstanding. Mm. No, I'm serious. Nothing happened. Fivia. So are these all we have? And Cosma have been asked for both streets. That means I have to go to the market soon. So much. Don't worry, just go. I'll call you when I need Thank you. you. You have carried your wahala to my shop again. Because I will not steal any wahala if you don't stop stealing our customers. Huh? Is it my fault that customers prefer to make their hair here? Uh. Eh? Mm -hmm. Hey! Hey! Trouble the sleep, Nyanga, call wake up. What can you do? What will you do? What will I do? Yes! What can you do? What's going on? What's going on? Hey! What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? What's going who is this one? Excuse so because one man is giving you small change, you know what that be? You better be careful so you don't drop another pastor child. Let me hand over. So you brought your two left legs to my shop. It's the audacity for me. So now if you don't leave the shop right now, I swear. What will you do? What? Thank you for controlling my anger. Thank you. <laughs> God just saved this girl. God bless mommy. God bless Auntie Vivian. God bless my home in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Good night, honey. Mommy, am I a bastard? What? Why would you say that? Where did you hear that from? 
They buy my skin cell soup because I don't have a daddy. You are not a bastard, okay? Okay, mommy. Good. Can I create JP my daddy? Baby, it's not as simple as that. All oh, my friends go have daddies. Baby, you will have a daddy very soon, okay? I promise, mommy. I promise. Good night, mommy. Good night, my love. You are not a bastard, okay? Okay. You want to cuddle mommy? Yeah. Alright. Okay. Yeah. Scoop down. Scoop down. Mm -hmm. Good night, baby. You see, I'm going to that school to deal with that boy and then follow him to his house to deal with his parents. <laughs> For not teaching him manners, what sort of nonsense is that? Are you going to go to Tina's house and beat her up? See, all I need is direction. You're not messing up. Just give me go and let me go and deal with that area. She goes. Uh -uh. Vivian, how many people are you going to fight? Look, no matter how hard I work to create a better future for me and my child, this society will never make me forget about my past. They will continually remind me that I raised my child without a father by my side. Why do you care about what the society thinks? I don't care! If I can all go to hell for all I care, this year don't care! You don't understand, do you? Whenever someone knows that I am a single mother, they look at me with so much disdain. Like I have some sort of disease. Even in church. They look at me with so much condemnation. Like I committed the greatest sin. I had sex out of a marriage and had a child out of wedlock. Like they are not sleeping around. They are not tattooing around. At least you get free enough to have that child and not commit an abortion. Uh -uh. But like some people. See, you should be commended and not ostracized. You don't see it like that. I don't care. You have a man who loves you and your child. You actually think AJ would love a single mother like me? You think so? Akata, why would you say that? You shouldn't allow your insecurities to define you. You are beautiful. You are hardworking. With a wonderful soul like Daniel. Any man should consider himself lucky for having you in his life. Vivian, you know, you have so much light in you. Thank you. Thank you for all the kind words and encouragement. I don't know what we'll do without you in our lives, myself and Daniel. Thank you. Oh, are you crying? <laughs> You're making me want to cry. Thank you so much. I am lucky to have you both in my life too. <laughs> okay. And don't beat up any words. I, I will. It's not worth it. I still will. Mm -hmm. Nobody comes and mess with you and goes out for you. You know that, right? It's fine. Thank you. <laughs> Hello, who is this? This is Fred. Who? Fred Adigwe. Hello, Wakata. Are you there? <clears throat> yes. Yeah, yes. Um, please, what, what exactly do you want? Um, this, is, this is actually a messenger call. I searched for you on Facebook and I found your contacts. Agatha, I've been looking for you for a very long time. I heard that your parents, they moved to the village and that your siblings, they no longer live in the old neighborhood. Agatha, I'm sorry. I know that I abandoned you and I treated you wrongly, but I was scared, Agatha. You were scared? 
Imagine how I felt. I was 17, Fred. 17. Agatha, you, you know I was 19 years old. I was just a young boy. I mean, what, what would I have done with the baby? Babe, you should have thought about that before you took my virginity. Agatha, look, I am sorry. I'm very sorry. I, I can't take back the past, but I, I mean, I'd like to make peace with you, Agatha. You know what? I can't do this, okay? I, please don't contact me again. Alright, bye. Danny's father called you. Yeah. How did he get your number? Well, he said it's some messenger called thing on Facebook. So what did he want? Honestly, I don't know and I don't care. Don't say that. <sighs> Didn't you promise Danny that he was going to see his father someday? He has been without a father for seven years. I'm sure he will survive the rest of his life without one. You are being too harsh right now. At least just hear the guy. Do you know what that man put me through? He looked my parents in the eyes and, and swore that he never slept with me. My father threw me out, even before he shot me, but that actually helped me out. I'll soon still be on the streets. No, I'm not being harsh, so. I'm not being harsh. You should just leave us the hell alone. You have to say. Look, Agatha, I want to make amends for the way I treated you. And I also want to get to know my son. Over my dead body. Don't talk like that, Agatha, please. Don't talk like that. Oh, so you remember that you have a son after seven years, Abby? Look, Agatha, things happened. I traveled to the US. A lot of things have happened since then. Listen, let me send you some money to take care of you and my son. Let me send you some money, Agatha, please. Look, you think you can actually bribe us with foreign currency? Oh, come on. I'm not going to bribe you. Don't say these things. I don't wish to bribe you, Agatha. Please. Okay, fine. What exactly is your son's name? Agatha. You know what? We don't need you. And please don't call me anymore. Rubbish. Who are you quarreling with? You heard me. Uh, please, where is Daniel? He's watching Katana. You won't stop calling me. You can't deny Daniel the opportunity to know his father. Watch me. Oh, so I should tell Daniel that his father has reappeared again and he, what if he disappears? There is nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with him disappearing again. With him knowing, it will break Daniel. What is wrong with you? Just do the need for me. Need for oh, you call my dad. Can I see him now? Can I see him now? But I... Uh, honey? No. Okay, no, you can't. Can you come inside, please? But you promise. Honey, I know what I said. Just come inside, please. I thought you said he was watching cartoon. He was? Oh, oh, now you want to blame me that he found out the truth. Just do the needful, it won't hurt. The needful is staying the hell away from Fred. It will break Daniel. Daniel, I'm doing this because I love you and I want to protect you. Your father is a very bad man and I'm afraid he will hurt you. Daniel, don't I look at me when I'm talking to you. Daniel. Babe, Daniel thinks I'm keeping him from his father, and I'm not really trying to protect him. I don't want him to get hurt. Honestly, I'm confused. Let the boy reconnect with his father. What? Every child needs a father. Especially a boy. 
You try to stop him, he will resent you for the rest of his life. What if he gets hurt? What if he disappears? He, he actually disappeared seven years ago. What's to say that he's not, he's not going to do it again? And if he does that, he won't hate you anymore. He will just be angry at his father for not being there for him. Okay, fine. But what about us? How would this affect our relationship? Us? Yes. How? I don't have any problem with a man connecting with his son. Now, if that man happens to shine his eye your way, we're going to have problems. <laughs> I will go John Wick on it. I don't <laughs> share. <laughs> I don't have eyes for you. I only have eyes for you. Mm. That's why I'm over here. <laughs> you may get lucky. Actually, I'm the lucky one. Yeah. I'm the lucky one. I'm the lucky one. <laughs> If you look your way, <laughs> oh God! Don't worry, I'm only looking your way. He's lost his mind, then. Yeah. Where are you? Thank you. I just said to tell you that um, he's been head up. So oh. you should wait for him. Oh, okay. Well, I'll so please feel free. Make yourself at home. Thank you. Can I offer you something to do? Oh, no, no, no. No, I'm fine. Oh, come on. Don't tell me you're still feeling shy around me. <laughs> this is your home, too. Feel free to go to the kitchen and move up something delicious because your boy here is starving. <laughs> Well, I can eat a human being. Okay, don't eat a human being, okay? I will just make something. Just All right. Saying. Okay. <laughs> nice choice. Do you like the food? Thank you. Yeah. Hi. Sharon. Who is she? She's my friend. Um, Agatha. Meet um, Sharon. Sharon. Agatha. Hello. Hmm. It's delicious, but something is missing. Can somebody get me some juice? Or is this how you said you get from the house? Hey, watch it, Charlie. Don't worry, don't worry. I'll get her some juice. Hey, love. Hey. Hey. Sorry, I'm late. It's okay. How did your meeting go? You know how I do. See the deal, yo. I should be proud of you, man. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> What's wrong? Some girl was here earlier. What girl? Oh, Sharon. You met Sharon. Yeah. Is she still here? Why is she bothering you? Oh, yeah, Judy called me, I'm sorry. She was being to you. I, I, I don't know where Judy finds these girls. Honestly, I feel like you can do it better than all these low-class girls, if you ask me. She's Judy's girlfriend? Of course. <laughs> you thought she was my girlfriend? I don't know. Oh, huh. you actually thought she came here to see me? Oh, I already have a girlfriend. 
Why are you looking at me like that? You think I'm lying? You don't trust me. It's not that. Oh, I trust you. It's just the way she was acting like she's the lady of this house. She can act however she wants. All I know is there's only one woman that owns my heart. And that's you. Now, can we stop talking about Judy's latest film and focus on your genius level boyfriend? Because I put in, I put in some work. Congratulations, baby. I'm sure you can do better than that. Okay. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Hi. Just in the description you find me. Okay. Has company. Babe, why do we have to leave every time he has company? Why? It's, you pay rent too. It's it's bro code. You can't understand. Bro code? Code. How? It's not that deep. Look, I is that mind. I mind. Let's go in. Babe, 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 it's babe. your house too. But you'll do the same thing for me. Babe? Yes. No. Babe, yes. this is not fair, yes. honestly. Yes. Every time he has company, we have to go somewhere else. How, why? How about I take you to my favorite restaurant? Every time. Just stay in. Vivian. Hmm? I think Eddie is cheating. <coughs> Are you okay? Are you alright? Do, do you need water? <laughs> what are you talking about? Every other day, I see girls trooping in and out of his house, and he's saying that he's Jide's girlfriend. And how are you sure he's not telling you the truth? Because the guy doesn't look like a womanizer. Did they write it on their forehead? Look, that guy's always on his laptop. So, have you not heard the saying that says, those that walk also like to play hard? I beg, please, stop looking for trouble where there's none. Okay? He loves you, and he can never do that. Here you go. Oh. Thanks. <laughs> You're nice enough. You're welcome. You know, it's hard for me to actually think that you have time for girls. Because you're always working. Oh, what can no play next to you, don't worry. True. Why don't you just get a good girl? Someone who will take care of you. Not these ones that come out because of what they can get from you. I will. Someday soon. You're better. I have to take this call. Excuse me. I'm coming. Oh, hello. Hi. Um, welcome. Do you want to sit while I, while you wait for Jide? Man, who says I'm here to see Jide? <laughs> but you're Jide's girlfriend. <laughs> Are you trying to be funny or what? Ah. Uh, I am here to see my boyfriend. Please, tell your girlfriend to stop bothering me. Everybody, just calm down, okay? Oh, wait, Jide. Is this your babe well in the head? Or why else is she claiming me? You are the me? one that is not well in the head. Me. What do you mean by wait. that? I'm not fighting. Are you watching this game? Hold it, knock us off. Hey, what are you doing? Are you crazy? You are crazy. Are you are mad. You are the one that is mad. Look at this. Excuse me. Tell me. Behold her. 
before I close my eyes and open it, this big shop should be out of here. Get out of this house! So all this your double! All this your house is your double! You are still there! You are still there! Please, stop crying. You're going to get yourself sick. I cannot believe he just cheated on me. He promised that you will never break my heart. That is what he told me. They always say that. But are you sure she's really his girlfriend? Babe, she almost killed me. When she found out that was AJ's girlfriend. <coughs> she almost injured me. Are you... Seriously? See, she's so lucky I wasn't there. If not, I would have given her some mark on her face. What nonsense. Are you okay? Look, I'm so, so sorry she attacked you. I already called the police report to make sure she gets arrested. Really? Of course I did. Is she crazy? Why would she lay her hands on you? Because she told me she's your girlfriend. She is not. <laughs> she is not. I'm sorry I should have told you this before. I should have. But she, she's obsessed with me. And I already told her I'm not interested. But she won't leave me alone. But, but, but you, you told me that she, she's Jide's girlfriend. She is. I mean, she, she's one of the girls that Jide sleeps with. So she tried to transfer the affections onto me and I already told her no. I mean, all I want Jide's seconds when I already have a girl I'm crazy about. Baby. Listen. You have to trust me here. If not, what are we doing? I am in love with you. I'd rather die than hurt you. You promise. With all my heart. I'm so sorry. No, I'm sorry. I no, 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 you don't, you don't have any reason. You don't have any reason to apologize. No, I, I, I do. I, 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 I do not believe I, her. I promise you, this will never happen again. Okay. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't believe you. I'm sorry. But you're the one that said that you're not accusing without proof. Now you're saying he's guilty. Are you sure he's not really sleeping with that girl? But he said he's not. And you believe him. Vivian, I'm confused. You used to be AJ's number one fan. Now you don't like him anymore. Why? I am just looking out for you. I'm not sure AJ is the person we think he is. That's not true. Wait, are you not saying that we can't trust AJ? I'm just saying you should be careful. Vivian, I love AJ and he loves me too. Look, I'm not going to toss my relationship to the cop because of one guy that actually dumped me and my child when I needed him the most. I won't do it. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be here today. I need to talk to you. Yeah, yeah we'll just talk some time and somewhere else, okay? I can't wait until then. I am tired of this hide and seek relationship. You need to break up with Agatha. Okay, I will. All right, but let's talk about. I mean this. now. No, no, I can't do that right now. Now, come on. Come Why on. not? You said you love me. I'm not her. Of course I do. You also said you were dating her because you felt sorry for her. Yeah, but. Like, <laughs> Keep playing with her feelings like that. She's got a child to consider. That's why I can't break up with her now. That won't be fair. That won't be fair. Think about it now. Come on. Hmm? Come on. If you don't tell her that's the truth, I will. Okay, let's calm down. Okay? I'll break up with her. Don't worry. I promise. You promise? Of course, I do. You're the girl, huh? Yeah. You have to do that first. Give me a sec, I'm just...
this is not what it looks like. Uh, she actually came here to uh, tell me how her mom is doing. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. well, you didn't tell me that at home. Oh, sorry. I, I, I didn't plan to come this way anyway. <laughs> and how did you know where he stays? Oh, after the whole helping her mom out, I said that we should exchange numbers so I could keep track. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? I'm good. I'm You're good. good. I'm good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is very weird, but okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, guys. You're good. Um, just give me a sec. Can we talk outside? Real uh, quick. You want to talk outside? Yes. Why? Uh, I've got nothing to hide, do you? Uh, um, babe, what is she doing? I thought you said you got her arrested. <laughs> me? Arrested? That's a new one. AJ. Isn't this nice though? I mean, you have three girls you're sleeping with under the same roof at the same time. Uh, I'm sorry, three girls? Are you really as dumb as you look? Maybe you try counting. One, two, three. <laughs> She's lying. Oh, you two even know each other. Wow, AJ. Now you're sleeping with two friends. That's like getting two s for the price of one. Hey, listen to one. <laughs> you guys are about to get beaten of her life if I slap you. Look at her tiny hands. Hey, are you holding me? Wait, wait, hold on. Are you sleeping with Of course she is! Can't you see? <laughs> sleeping with my boyfriend. What? She's sleeping with AJ. AJ is not your boyfriend. Get it? AJ is my mm. boyfriend. Mm. What if AJ is nobody's boyfriend? This man here is married with two kids and they live in Abuja. Look, the client wants us to make an app okay. that can track the product from the moment the order is placed okay. to when it's delivered. What? Yeah. But why not make another app that can also track the delivery guys? Uh, I mean, more often than not, there have been cases of them taking off for God knows where and making a delivery of 40 minutes, four hours later. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's a... That's a very, very great idea. Yeah. So we'll make that, we'll make that one too. That's good. That's good. The kind of like that. That's a good idea. It's yeah. a good idea, man. It's a good idea. Please, babe, I'm sorry for wasting your time. I'm not going anywhere with you until you apologize for, for keeping me here. You know what? I'm tired of your ugly ass harassing me all the time. Did you just call me ugly? Yes, I did. I don't even know what I'm doing with you when there are other preacher better get out there. You know what? I'm leaving. Find your way home. Wait, what? You can't just leave me here! You said you have to find your way home. <laughs> hey, you okay? I promise you I wasn't eavesdropping. I just couldn't help overhear your conversation. A drop dead gorgeous lady like you shouldn't be crying over a guy like that. He doesn't deserve your tears. You think I'm drop dead gorgeous? What? Babe, you stop traffic. That's if you're not already stopping traffic. What am I saying? You probably are. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Can I give you a lift somewhere? My car is right outside. Okay. Thank you. My pleasure. I'm AJ. Honestly, I think the world was actually made in eight days. God rested on the seventh day. Just have enough energy to make you an eight. <laughs> oh, AJ. It's too much. Yeah, that's too much. much. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not, I'm not. I'm not used to this. I'm just. Uh, I'm nervous. But I'm just trying to say all the right things so you. I don't know. Maybe like me. 
You don't have to. It's good to hear. <laughs> I mean, I can't wait for you guys to meet. Right. <laughs> you're blushing. What do you want? <laughs> I'm just feeling excited. Mm. Uh -huh. Hi! Mm. How are you doing? I'm good. Um, AJ meets Vivian. Vivian, AJ. Vivian! Vivian, very nice to meet you, Vivian. Same here. <laughs> yeah, Vivian here is my best friend, my sister, the second mother to Danielle. That's a lot of acronyms. I mean, and she deserves every one of it. I'm sure. I'm so sure. <laughs> okay, shall we order something? Before we order anything, mm -hmm. I brought something for you and Danny. Okay. Oh, babe. I can't believe you are the AJ my friend has been talking about. You lied to me. You said your name was Johnson. Actually, my name is Anthony Johnson. AJ for short. <laughs> so that makes it easy for you to sleep around with different names. That's not what it is, Vivian. Come on now. What are you doing with my best friend? I feel like I got her a lot. You like her a lot? Yeah. What about your wife and your kids? You haven't changed. Listen to me. John C. AJ or whatever you call yourself. Agatha is like my sister. She has been through a lot. You have to break up with her and stay away from her permanently. You know that will only hurt us some more. What do you want to tell me? Let me go first. AJ said he's going to give us money to start our own salon. Yes, he's going to give us money for the shop, to rent the shop, to buy everything we need. Like our dreams are finally coming true. Are you serious? Yes. Ah, what, why are you standing like this? Why are you, are you acting like this now? I am happy, okay? It's just that it's a lot of money. How are we going to pay back? He doesn't want us to pay back. He wants us to see it as a gift. <laughs> yes. That kind of money, a gift. You're supposed to be excited. I am excited, okay? I'm happy about it. It's a wonderful news. Are you sure? Yes! <laughs> no, 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 that's, that's the spirit. Not this, all, all these things you be... Sorry, no, see your no. There are customers inside you. Before both of you be hanging out here, you look like Agama Lizard and you from. It's, it's a bad time. Then, no, 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 no. I think, see, leave her. Very soon, we will not see her face anymore. We we'll have a whole shot. Yes, so, very soon. Let's go to pass first now. How's your mom? Oh, she's fine, man. She was discharged today. Ah, that's great. That's I such a relief. <laughs> I really don't know how to say thank you, Regine. I don't know what would have become my mom's fate if you had it come true for us. Come on. Uh, come off it. <laughs> Besides, it was a human thing to do, right? You have always been generous. Despite your other flaws. <laughs> Vivian, come on. I've apologized so many times. I, I'll apologize again. I'm sorry. And that makes it okay. AJ, you lied to me. You told me you were single. Meanwhile, you had a family stashed somewhere. And you even cheated on me with several women. I will forever regret doing it. What I did was wrong, I know, but all I can do is ask for your forgiveness. That's, that's all I can do. I promise it will never happen again. You 
broke my heart three years ago. I loved you. <laughs> three years ago feels like yesterday. I, I am still trying to pick up the pieces. And I'll never forgive myself for what I did. Because after you left, everything just crumbled. I wasn't going to tell you this, but my wife and I have been separated for a while now. I've been all by myself. What I'm trying to say is, Vivian, I miss you. I miss you so much. I missed you too. Sorry, please forgive me. I didn't mean for it to happen, I swear. Why didn't you tell me that she was married? And that you guys dated? Honestly, I wanted to, but you were so happy with the shop and I didn't want to get your heart broken again. You should have thought about that before sleeping with my boyfriend. Oh. I couldn't resist him. His generosity, his kindness. Wait. All the money that you were spending, did you get it from AJ? No wonder you wanted me to break up with him and go back to Daniel's father so that you can have access to him without interference, right? No. No. I wanted you to end everything with AJ because I knew he was married and he couldn't give you the future you and Daniel wanted. Oh, wow, but you were comfortable dating him even though he was married. Sorry. Please. You know, if anybody would have told me that you would do this to me, I would have sworn on my son's life. Thank you. It's true what they say. Don't touch me. The people closest to you are the ones that hurt you the most. Shame on you, Vivian. Shame, don't, don't, don't touch me.
Agatha. You can't continue like this. I know. I know I am the reason you are going through all of this. But please, consider your, your health and Daniel. Be outside. I pick you. I'm not gonna talk to me. Your homework afterwards. Okay, mommy. Okay, love. What? I have said I am sorry. Please forgive me. Forgive you? You did something as terrible as that. I expect me to forgive you. Okay, see. I don't have anything to do with AJ and I have cut off from her. Honestly, him. I do not care. As soon as I can save enough money, I am done with shared apartments. <laughs> Come on now. It hasn't got into that. Okay, see, I promise it's never going to happen again. Vivian, just. You can't talk to me. Yeah! Just, just tell me what you need me to I don't need anything. I just need you to get out of my. No, Vivian, Vivian, please stop fighting. Mommy, please, can you forgive her? Don't worry, we'll be fine. Okay? Okay. Agatha, wait now, please, please. See, I, I know I'm married, I know, but see, how my wife has been separated for years now. So that's an excuse for you to go out sleeping with girls? And I should have told you about Vivian, but I, I, I didn't know how you would take it. So I, I was trying to wait for the right time. And Sharon? She, she's different. She's an old flame from a relationship that ended before we even met. She just keeps coming around. You know, you have a lot of excuse for everything. Agatha, it's not an excuse. It's, it's not. And I feel very, very terrible about what the way things are between us. Just please. Just let me explain. Please, I, I, I miss you and I miss, I miss Daniel so much. And I don't know what I'll do if I don't see two of you again. So just please, just give me some minutes to explain. I, I do want you to take me back. Just, just, just listen to what I have to say. Please. 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 Hi. 
What's up, G? Uh, how's it going? I just need to tidy off some loopholes and it's ready. Mm. Agatha, is that you? That's me. Hi. Uh, how about you um, go upstairs and wait for me? Hmm? Okay. How about I go to the kitchen and make you something to eat? It's even better. <laughs> Thanks, right. love. How long will it take you to finish this thing, dude? <laughs> Son of a bitch. So you got to to forgive you. <laughs> the reason end up coming back, my G. <laughs> you all shit so messed up, my guy. <laughs> so, yeah, let's do this. Hey, wifey, how you doing? How are my little girls? What are you saying? You are the only girls I care about. <laughs> Oh, really? This one you are looking for something classy. Are you trying to impress our or you go boyfriend? Well, he gave me money, so I thought to buy a great ring. Ha! Huh? Please, oh, try and remember me in your paradise. At least, even if it's 40k a week. I can manage. What's the key we? Huh. But then we are taking attachments. Ah 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 No now. Ah ah. Ah. Oh. Please. Come in. Who are you calling? <laughs> Who is Toby? <laughs> He's just a friend. I just dialed AJ's number on your phone. He saved us, Toby. It's not what you think. It's what exactly do I think? Are you actually sleeping with him when you promised that you will not do it anymore? You know, how shameless can you be? How shameless can you be? You are the one who is shameless. Uh -uh. Oh, you think I don't know that you are back with him, even though he's married? I don't Please. know what you're talking about. Stop lying. At least I'm not the one who has a boyfriend in London sleeping with a married man in Nigeria. Look, AJ is going to divorce his wife and marry me. That's what he said. AJ is not going to marry you. Because he loves me. No, he loves me. You wish. Better go and start doing something with your baby like that and leave, and leave AJ for, for single ladies like me. I'm like, shit. Are you being serious? Vivian! First of all, I want to say thank you for answering my call. I was led by the Spirit to speak to both of you. I have never seen both of you fight and quarrel since you moved into our building. Both of you have been like sisters, which is actually what I admire. In fact, I'm sure both of you didn't know how much I struggled to figure out which among you is Daniel's mom. That's how close you were. Now, knowing that both of you are at each other's throat made me wonder. So, tell me. What is the problem? Thank you, Ma. All the men that I have met in the past, they've treated me with so much disdain. 
just because I'm a single mother. They, they don't care for me. They just want to have sex with me and, mm. and run off. But my, I met somebody that cares about me. Mm. Cares not only for me, for my child. That loves me genuinely. And my so-called sister sabotaged it. Evian. I didn't chase after him. We had a relationship before he met you. That ended three years ago. But you still went ahead to sleep with him, knowing fully while I was chasing him. When I could not resist him, because he is the man of my dream man. After all, you have Daniel's father. Why can't you just leave this one man for Because me? he's the man of my dreams too. I learned that this man is a married man with kids. How wonderful can he be? I mean, a man who's obviously cheating on his wife and cheating on both of you at the same time. Anyway. Both of you will do something for me. You will get a piece of paper. Write down the qualities you want in your man and the ones you don't want. Children, no fighting. Um, Vivian, can you read out the qualities you wrote down? He must be generous, kind, caring, and loving. Okay. I see it's almost the same thing as at the roots. Agatha, can you read out the things you don't want in your man? I don't want a man that lies, a man that cheats. A man who is dishonest. A man that is not trustworthy. So, how do you people rate your EG based on what you wrote? Pastor Kiki, I don't think you understand. I can't stay away from EG. I finally found a man that loves and cares for me. I, I, how, how do I stay away from him? All my life I have taken care of my son. Now he takes care of me. And that's your love language. Huh? I mean, love language or love languages is how you give and take love. You feel loved when someone does something for you which is known as act of service he's so generous when my mom was in the hospital aj sorted all the bills and then we were even together Tell me, how many men would want to consider helping you without asking for something in return? I see you really like to receive gifts. He noticed my phone was bad and he bought me a new one. He constantly anticipates my needs, even before I ask him. AJ is the perfect man for me. After listening to both of you individually, I have come to the conclusion that your AJ is a predator that preys on women's emotions. He has been able to deduce what makes a woman feel loved 
and appreciated, which makes it difficult for them to resist him. Agatha, you're not used goods. You are not inferior because you have a child out of wedlock. I just think you're a beautiful, intelligent, hard-working woman. So stop thinking that you need a man to find yourself worth. You are perfect just the way you are. Vivian. Those gifts that man buys for you is not because he's generous. No. He just wants to keep you indebted to him. So that he can use you whenever he wants and you can't say no. He's not a perfect man. He's not anything close. In fact, he's a dishonest, lying, cheating man who will bring you nothing but pain and misery and it's not even worth losing his sister for that man is a debaucher a corruptor in fact in layman's language he's a player he would never genuinely love anybody because he is so self-absorbed for him it's the game the chasing the thrill of having to catch his prey like a predator that he really is but if you don't need that kind of man in your life you deserve better listen to me ladies it is time to walk away from this toxic relationship by dumping this man. Let him go. There are friends that should be kept close like a sister. That's what both of you are. Why are you letting some lying, wicked man cause confusion in your midst? Would you have it so great? Don't lose it because of him, it's not worth it. It's time to walk away, both of you. Did you hear me? I'm so glad you called. I, <laughs> I actually thought you were going to break up with me when I'm I did. I'm breaking here. up with you. Sorry, well, I didn't. I didn't catch you. You heard. Me. What are you doing, Agatha? We, we have a good thing going. You don't want to lose this. Do we? AJ, you are a married man. It's really even a marriage, to be honest. Is that so? Yes. Look, we deserve better, my son and I. And you're not going to give us the kind of future that we actually deserve. Look, you, you don't know that. You are toxic. You are so toxic. And honestly, I don't want any part of it. So goodbye.
sorry. Please, please forgive me. Baby. Thank you.